What's up, y'all? So, I'm going through these YouTube streets, and here we see Nina Boy is back in the headlines, okay? Um, yeah, with this buffoonery shit again. So, let me get this straight, right? Mm. Mm-mm-mm. Nina, there, there definitely has to be something wrong with Nina Boy mentally. Niggas on the motherfucking short slow bus for sure. Sit in the back seat with the helmet on. Yeah, he's sitting in the seat that have the seat belt, the special seat. Yeah, he definitely uh are one of them. Yeah, he he is he is because you get your ass, you got the nerve to get your ass out here and. Get yourself caught up in another situation to now where somebody else want to beat your ass now. And now you getting out here talking about you accept the fucking challenge. Now, it's one thing. You know, we see this nigga can't fight in the first fight with Bosco, right? You willing to take that chance with with, with China Mac? Not even, you know... You you willing to take that chance? You willing to go publicly and get your ass beat by China, man? I mean, uh, now it, it's one thing you find your own people. You know what I'm saying? You get in the ring, you got your ass beat. We clowned you. We, we was on your ass, right? Because you was talking all this tough Tony talk shit, right? About what the fuck you can do, how you can lay hands on motherfuckers out here pretending you going to the gym, practicing, you not... You know what I'm saying? We ain't seen this nigga in the gym since. So let let we already know we about to start seeing this nigga back in the gym. Okay, yeah, that's what we, yeah, he he finna start preparing for this shit. Yeah, we about to start seeing this nigga drink Capri Suns, baby waters. You know what I'm saying? You probably eat him a little banana here and there. Nigga, don't forget ya. you. You take them motherfucking pills. You you too motherfucking old to be getting your ass out here uh, taking up some challenges with somebody. You know what I'm saying? Talking about you want to take the challenge and fight. And you on motherfucking four bottles of high blood pressure pills and shit, okay? Yeah, and we know damn well you don't eat healthy, okay? Yeah, we we, we know that. So we know your ass is out of shape and unhealthy, and you don't eat healthy. So that right there, you you need to think about all that before you decide to take a motherfucking challenge. You know, it ain't about, oh, trying to let everybody think that you hard or you going to... You know what I'm saying? Nigga, just stay in your motherfucking lane so that don't nobody feel the need to call your soft, sorry, funky looking ass out. Okay? Now, it's going to be real fucked up to see him get beat up by Asian guy. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be a whole nother level of motherfucking roasting. Okay, if you take your sta- your stupid ass out here and go and fight him, all right? You too old to be out here fighting, and I think you, I- I'm not sure what's going on in your head, but you can't fucking fight. What part of that don't you understand? If you can't fight, you fucking can't fight. That's just it. You can't go and train and learn how to motherfucking fight within the next couple of months, nigga. And we know you're not about to be putting in the work to do it. Now, we can have somebody who out here who determined, you know what I'm saying? And they can get out here and actually not know how to fight, get trained to fight, and then go and be somebody ass. We got those people, and it's a small percentage of them motherfuckers that will be able to pull that off. Not you, Nina, boy. You, you're not able to pull that off at all. At all. So why the fuck are you getting yourself out here? And we already know you taking up a challenge, but I can guarantee you in his head, he trying to think of the best excuse to get up out of this shit to not make himself look like he a punk ass nigga. He is. Yeah, if they ain't about, no, nah, nigga, I ain't about to fight you because they ain't about, mm, they not finna be paying me this, that, and I'm not about to be doing this shit for free. I got bills and shit. Mm, I'm not about to be. Yeah, if you ain't about to be doing this, then we not finna do it. Yeah, well, if it ain't finna be here or whatever, then I'm not about to be doing all that. Oh, well, if y'all not about to pay me to go out here and do all this, then I'm not about to do it. You about to be making up all motherfucking type of excuses because you scared any motherfucking way. You don't really want no smoke like that. So why you out here trying to act like you do and putting yourself in a situation to where you want it? Nigga, you don't want it? What is wrong with you? And here we go again. Here go the motherfucking merry-go-round. And people wonder why I get my ass out here and talk shit about this nigga. 
Stay in your little parley line lane that you got going on, nigga. Do that. All this other shit you trying to do, it's not for you, nigga. It's not for you. You know what I'm saying? Fighting just not your thing, dude. Yeah, it's just it's just not for you. You just not no fighter like that. Yeah, no, you're not no motherfucking fighter like that. Yeah. You need to go and try to do something else because that's not that's that don't fit you, boo. It, that 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 jacket right there just don't fit you too well. So stop trying to squeeze your fat, funky looking ass in it, cause it, you just it's just not about the workout, nigga. So whatever you gotta do, come up with an excuse of how you gonna wiggle your ass up out of this shit. Okay, all right.